Good morning, you join me at Longbridge today. Another day off work, just using up the last of the holiday before the new lot starts. Um, and I've come up here because there's some lovely carp in here. I know it's going to be quiet, especially during the week and at this time of year. And I'm the only person here, which is brilliant. Um, I've had two laps of the lake. I've had a good look around, margins, looking for bubblers, looking for fish that are going to roll. Or any signs really, but I can't find anything at the moment. Um, there are a couple of little back bays and channels where you usually find a few fish, but maybe not this time of year. At the moment, the water's going to be really cold. The fish are going to be lethargic, um, and I'm going to have to basically put a bait in their front room. So the obvious feature is this big island that you can see just out in front of me. Um, there's always fish patrolling around it. So I think I'm just going to sit put today. I'm not going to be stalking. I'm not going to be wandering around all over the place using up a load of energy. Um, I think I need to be quiet, so I think I need to set a couple of traps near this island um, and just sit on my hands for the day and see what happens. It's a lovely morning, it's really atmospheric, it's really misty. It's been misty since yesterday afternoon um, and it makes for a lovely backdrop. But yeah, well, uh, I'm going to get the kit set up now, get some ground bait made. I'm going to put some ground bait out there, uh, just a small bit of bait. They're not going to be eating loads, not this time of year, not with the water this cold, but just a small bit of bait and uh, might just stop them in their tracks as they drift around the island so we'll see how we go so at the moment i'm just knocking up a little bit of ground bait and um, the idea is to put some balls of ground bait out to the island um, and produce more of a carpet feed than a load of particles on the bottom um, so i've got some ground bait here some some green envy carp type ground bait um, a few sour boilies that i'm crushing up don't want any big particles in there because i won't be able to bind it into balls but um, just crushing up a few, few boilies, not many, just maybe half a kilo in there. I should put a tin of sweet corn and the juice in as well, and that'll do. That'll be enough attraction for them.
but I couldn't do it any longer. Um, I've had the rod out for about an hour and a half. Very, very little's happened. Um, so I, I just can't sit there and watch motionless rods and it's not the way I fish. So uh, I've wound it in and luckily in the last half an hour or so, the sun's come out and it actually feels quite warm. So I've got a bucket of ground bait. I'm now going to take a little tour around the lake and see if I can actually find some fish. There's loads of margins, there's some deep margins, there's some shallows, there's bays, there's all sorts here. So it seems a shame to just sit in one spot and hope that the fish will come to me. They're going to be held up somewhere, I just need to find out where. So on my toes time. Well, as you can probably gather by now, my lips are moving, but there's actually no sound coming out. And that's because I forgot to plug the microphone into the camera. But there you go, these things happen. So what I was actually saying was that I had no confidence whatsoever going into the afternoon. I'd fished hard in the morning, baited up spots. Um, I'd fished a few different areas, uh, but there was no signs of fish at all. I just couldn't find any, I couldn't locate any at all. So I got drawn to a little back bay where I'd had some success in the past at this time of year and flicked a couple of rods close in and basically sat back and chilled underneath the brolly because there were some showers coming over and the left hand rod was away just out of the blue so caught this gorgeous little mirror um, wonderful to get off the mark and brilliant to catch a long bridge fish because the last time I came I didn't actually catch any Just looking fish that is another nice dark one hopefully it's some audio this time i can see the little bars working so hopefully you can actually hear what i'm saying but yeah put that rod back out again within about 10 minutes the same rod was away again little yellow pop-up just fished about an inch off the bottom um, and just a couple of handfuls of chopped up baits over the top wow please that's gorgeous proper winter colors on that one let's spin around if you'll let me scales on that that's immaculate that is that's gorgeous well pleased <laughs> 